All right, Ash, uh, great couple games. I mean, you had the walk-off, and then you rolled that over into game one and, you know, got on base twice with two real solid hits. So just tell us what you saw, how you felt today. Yeah, you know, I think everyone, I mean, I've been struggling, obviously, but, you know, without the push of my teammates, I couldn't be here where I am today. And them just pushing me each and every day at practice to get better and staying on me and helping me there. I just couldn't do it without the help of my teammates and all my coaches. Take me through that at bat in the seventh inning. They kind of pitch around Cody, pitch around Doherty, basically kind of challenging you, and you made them pay. Take me through that at bat. Yeah, I was kind of ready for that because, you know, Jada and Shannon are big hitters, you know, so I was just going up with the mentality, like, to get a base hit, to move these runners and hopefully score them. So I was just looking for my pitch um, to hit, and um, obviously I got that, and I got it in. And, you know, all my teammates cheer me on. It's going to be better. And then only a few minutes after that, you start the scoring in the second game. Do you feel like the momentum from your game winner just kind of carried into the second one? For sure. I mean, it's def definitely a momentum thing. Um, I think it helped our team overall in the FGCU game. Um, momentum's a big thing we use here, and we just like to carry that with us, and that helps us win games. What can you say about Jada Cody there and the day she had offensively and defensively? Drove in nine runs, two homers. What's it like uh, watching that in person there? Man, Jada, she's a beast. Um, she kills it all the time. She works so hard to do that, and um, no one's going to see that, but we see it, and then she shows it on the field, and, man, it's great to be her teammate. I love being around her. So you've got a decent amount of games under your belt now You're in your freshman year. Just talk about your experience here so far. Yeah, definitely, um, you know, all the girls here have really made me feel welcomed and really helped me and pushed me where I don't feel like like I'm a new person here. I feel like I've been here um, just as long as any other girl. They really helped me with that, and um, they really just, you know, everyone thinks it's pressure when you're a freshman, but it's really not when you have teammates like them and coaches like them to comfort you all the time. What was it like catching a DeVoe there? She kind of really shut the door there for them there and uh, kept it at bay until the offense exploded and put the game away. Yeah, Angie, she's, she's a great one. She's, um, she's our annoying pitcher, as we call her, and she comes in there and she'll shut the door, and everyone hates, hates the hit against her because she's going to throw you off. She's great. You've got one more game tomorrow against FGCU. Again, what do you, what's your mindset going into that? You know, I'm just going to carry the momentum in from the weekend and use that, and the whole team's going to use that. And we're just going in with the same mindset, you know, beat them. You wear 27. I know you pay tribute to Aaliyah White, who wore that number in the fall, and really a touching tribute there. Do you feel you're more comfortable, more relaxed now? Can that hit kind of paid off? You had a big homer against Texas in Clearwater and hit against Florida, so you've been coming on. Yes. But do you think today is kind of like the new start for you? Yeah, definitely. Today has um, really created some momentum for me, and I'm just going to carry that over with me, you know, um, focus on the positives. Don't look on the negatives, and yep. Sweet. Great job. Thank y'all. Nice